We have a brand new copy type command under insert associative copy isolate object of feature. Before I demonstrate this, I first am going to create a different feature. And in this case, I'm performing an intersect. I'm going to intersect my ZX plane with the body that we see. Once I accept it, we will notice that this intersect command produced two sets of results. We have an upper shape and then we have a lower shape since my datum plane intersects the body two times. If I now perform a isolate object of feature, like I mentioned, this is a copy type command. I must first select a feature that contains multiple results. If a feature I select does not contain multiple results, I will get an error. Then I can select a proximity object. And a proximity object must be either a datum or a point. In my case, I have a datum. Once I select OK, the system automatically copied the result that's closest to the proximity object. And I can get a better look at this if I hide my original intersect. And we now can see this is my isolate object. If I was to take my datum plane, modify it, and move it downward, since my plane is closer to the bottom version, my isolate object jumped to the bottom. My next example contains a single sketch with three separate chains of curves within it. And the most important aspect of this is that this is a single sketch. Right from my repeat command, I'm going to go ahead and launch my isolate object again. I'll go ahead and select my single sketch. And then my proximity object, I will select my datum plane. Once I accept and I hide my original sketch, we can see that we just see the number one. I'm going to go ahead and extrude my isolate object. And we will reverse, subtract that away, and then hide my isolate. As I move my datum plane towards the middle region, the number two will appear. As I stretch it to the end, the number three will appear. Now there is an issue where if you did split the difference, the system is not going to be able to determine which isolate to copy. So I do get an error on my features. So my proximity object must be closer to one than the other. Using isolate object of feature is very useful when intelligent modeling is necessary for template design. For example, I have currently a isolate object feature on a sketch that contains multiple shapes that are used for a cutout. We can see that my proximity object is the upper quadrant point. Therefore, the system only produces the result closest to that quadrant point. In this case, we can see what shape is being used at the moment. That shape was then patterned around my sprocket design. If I change my diameter, my quadrant point adjusts automatically. Therefore, a new cutout is used. We'll change it one more time. And another shape is used. This is how isolate object of feature can be very useful for template design.